Good morning, my lovely ones. How are you, loves? Good morning, good afternoon, or good evening. Daily message or messages, and it's not going to be a long message right away. I'm going to say that. And what I want to say is getting ready for the weekly readings. I know many of you have been asking about the weeklies. The weeklies are going to be back. And came in here today to bring you that the weekly energies for the month of September might come today by the end of the day. As we know, we have just a few more days till we're getting into September month. And there is a lot more energies coming in because I see like an avalanche of energies coming in. So get ready, loves. But let's see here a little message for all of you who come in, in here. And us of tomorrow, we are going to resume the readings with individual zodiac signs at the end. But let's see what do we have for you, darlings. And I bet many, many of you still adjusting. And I'm still adjusting with the two kids in school. And trying to manage to be here and to be there. But yes, we're going to take one step at a time. Speaking also about the Virgo time. Making a new routine. New habits. And on the other side, flipping the coin. To not be too harsh on us, right? We have a three of swords underneath, loves. Six of swords. Wow, five of swords. Ace of wands. And three of wands. For some of you, it's kind of m moving away as far as possible, the better. As far as the better. And there's a situation here definitely needs to be seen much different than was before. Don't hesitate, loves, because I feel here for some of you still kind of hesitating. Six of Pentacles and King of Pentacles. This is related to a person or a situation at your work or career-wise or in your life. Somebody here is going to make a decision here and most likely this decision is definite with the two forms but it seems here someone is kind of breaking a cycle of stagnant energy congratulations loves let's see what this is about and what's the main message for you wow yeah now continue in the same way as you used to. When we have a tower moment, there's kind of something here, enough is enough, right? No longer. No longer, darlings. Queen of Cups, Six of Cups, Four of Swords, and the Moon. It's kind of scared the shit out of you to move forward, but you know it's necessary. Chariot. Two of Swords. Somebody here refused to move forward. I have a lot of water energy here. And look at this here. Six of uh, Wands. Six of Cups. And Two of Pentacles. It's kind of I'm moving, but is this something I want to? Look at this. Two of Swords. Two of Pentacles. It's like even though I'm scared about this massive change, massive turnaround of situation massive move because we have all the sixes here look at this six of swords six of wands six of cups and the six of pentacles it's kind of somebody here definitely needs stability i need to get the things in order and somebody here does this whatever here someone been it's quite hard to even imagine. But yes, could be also a family situation that no longer works. Or there's a situation here that is not getting better. And whatever here decision is made, 
with the two two of cups is the one missing so whatever now it's happening by the um, Scorpio season is Scorpio new moon and Scorpio new moon we have November 1st so now till November 1st it's like somebody here is giving them two months from now what's the tower here for high priestess whatever here is happening somebody here might not tell anyone but look at this chariot speaks about cancerian high priestess pisces tower moment scorpio moon pisces cancerian there's a lot of watery energy it's like it's like emotion wise someone feels like i need to get better for some somebody here is like emotional state emotionally they are not fulfilled or they are emotional situation emotional body or it's quite emotional somebody here needs to get better for others of you <clears throat> your endocrine system your emotional system needs to to work to to be healed or there's a need a lot of healing it's kind of nobody knows about this whatever it's happening wow look at this wheel of fortune the universe know nobody knows but the universe does but whatever here is it's a turning point in somebody's life we have the um, the world something here it's done and over but I feel here in the next six months is going to show. Okay, the two of swords. We have page of swords. The moon. We have five of cups. And the two of pentacles. Lovers. At least you are moving away. Whoever I'm speaking. At least you do something. That's what I'm hearing. One more card next to the moon and five of cups. It's kind of somebody who's like, is done crying a river. Is done being there and complaining all the time. Is done to, to be same old, same old in the same pattern. Needs to fight for what's happening here. King of cups. So look at this, loves. Kings and queen of cups here. Yeah, there is a situation here that somebody here takes action. Two of Swords, Page of Swords, Knight of Swords. Yeah, this is a family energy, a situation that it's, it's going on for quite a while. Two of Pentacles and the Lovers, Page of Pentacles. Knight of Pentacles. Yes, this is a family energy. Somebody here is kind of like, I need to take responsibility for myself. And for the future, I have ahead of me. Whatever the energy is here. What's the Queen of Cups in here for? King of Wands. Queen of Wands wow and the star and five of pentacles here it's like somebody here is like done dreaming somebody here could could just dream towards things no more i have five of cups five of pentacles also, I have the Five of Swords. The Five of Wands is missing. And Five of Wands speaks about arguments, fights, troubles. Somebody here definitely is having, you know, arguments, fights for this. Like a fast, slow energy here. Okay. Whoever here decide what's the solution to it. Action. The Emperor, Ace of Cups, 
Knight of Cups and Nine of Cups, getting out of the comfort zone and letting go. Everything doesn't fulfill. What advice we have here? Page of Wands, Two of Wands, Eight of Pentacles. Deciding to put in work in the things that really matters. And also, this is about priorities. Straightening up the priorities. This is about a, a couple definitely here. That somebody here needs to get serious to do the, the right thing, the right energies. And somebody here is going to stop complaining and stepping out in their true power. Yes. So here we are, loves. Stepping up into the power. Absolutely. And that being said, loves, I wish you a great, beautiful day ahead. Blessings. And... Look at here. This is the, the Ten of Pentacles. I've been uh, saying given before the reading, but yeah, somebody here, it's kind of like getting things together, getting things in order to bring certain things for themselves. And for some of you, whatever here the situation was all over the place is going to start to build back. There is a build back energy here. But yes, yeah, somebody here needs to move away from a situation for sure. Love and light loves. And I'll see you tomorrow. Bye for now.